Project after project, growth is being seen across the city of Tallahassee with even more to come. Thanks for joining us for ABC 27 News at 6. I'm Channing Frampton. And I'm Ava Van Balen. Right now, tax dollars from the Blueprint Intergovernmental Agency are being used to fund 27 projects. Yeah, Florida State is now hoping to get renovations to Dope Campbell Stadium on that list. And as the debate plays out over whether the university should receive that money, ABC 27's Micah Cho is looking at how the agency has helped fund other university projects. The blueprint budget is made up out of your tax dollars. That money is then spent to fund economic and infrastructure opportunities here in Leon County. We at Blueprint take a portion of it. 12% goes to economic vitality for economic development purposes. Some goes to the city, some goes to the county. Tax dollars that Blueprint Susan Emanuel says is used to fund economic development and infrastructure projects in Leon County. In the past, Blueprint has funded projects for sports tourism, giving money to Tallahassee colleges. When you throw the basketball and you get into the hoop, the shot clock sometimes stops working. Heather Mitchell is the VP of Institutional Advancement for Tallahassee Community College. Mitchell says that their athletic facilities were in need of an upgrade when they asked Blueprint for $1 million in CARES Act funding in 2021, of which they matched with $2 million of their own money. Mitchell says improvements were needed to update things like their locker rooms, indoor batting cages, and covered seating for their outdoor facilities. During the vote for funding, Blueprint listed the economic investment for that project at $1.4 million. In 2020, Florida A&M University also benefited from Blueprint money with $10 million in improvements approved for Bragg Memorial Stadium for repair and repainting of steel frame infrastructure, as well as upgrades to restrooms to make them more handicap accessible. Now the board must decide if it will give Florida State $20 million to make repairs and upgrades to things like lighting, handrails, and making seating and parking more handicap accessible to Doak Campbell Stadium. The Blueprint Board, which is made up of Tallahassee City and Leon County Commissioners, will make a vote on that $20 million for Doak Campbell Stadium on Thursday. For now, in Tallahassee, Micah Cho, ABC 27. And the renovations at Doe Campbell Stadium are expected to cost around $120 million. $100 million of that money will come from Seminole Boosters.